Dynamic, diverse, and most definitely distinct. Here it comes now, heading pressure. Here we go, stand by. The Rolex China Sea Race starts from Hong Kong's imposing Victoria Harbour on Wednesday, the 27th of March. Getting out of the harbour is always very tactical. There's lots of tacks, lots of boats, sometimes there's other vessels, container ships coming through the harbour. Organised by the Royal Hong Kong Yacht Club, the race is Asia's premier offshore yachting event and attracts a top-class international fleet. You start in the city. One hour later, you're out at sea. Good luck. First held in 1962, the 565 nautical mile race follows the ancient trade routes through the unpredictable open waters of the South China Sea before transitioning into the Luzon coast and entering the pristine waters of Subic Bay in the Philippines for the finish. Lovely way to watch the sunrise. Overcoming the constantly shifting weather patterns plus challenging overnight conditions places a premium on tactics, tenacity and teamwork. I tell the guys you're fighting in the trenches and I'd like them to fight in the trenches the entire way to Subic. Returning for this unique test of seamanship is 2023 overall winner, Nick Southard's Whiskey Jack. And Ernesto Echao's Standard Insurance Centennial 5 will also be back, having last year become the first ever Philippines entry to take line honours. We're so happy that we were given the opportunity to be able to express ourselves. Thank you. It's just one of the most sensational sailing experiences, I think. The Rolex China Sea Race, the jewel of blue water racing in Asia.